Another area that I want to cover is what I would call visuals or maybe you want to call it stick tricks. I was really influenced by visual type drummers my whole career and I've always felt like that I wanted to learn how to incorporate some of that into my playing. So I would always work on like, you know, stick spinning, you know, it's mainly on breaks. I don't use it, utilize it so much in the context of playing grooves. I usually use it when there's a break in a song. I may hold my hands above my head and do this type of spinning. Sometimes just one hand spinning like that and sometimes both. Another trick that I like to use is when I'm playing a groove or time, maybe do what I call like stick bounces either off the hi-hat or the ride, something like this. You get the basic idea. Another thing I incorporate a lot is cymbal catches or playing my cymbals what I would call backwards or underneath. And I got that from watching guys like Buddy Rich, Louis Belson, a lot of big band drummers. Uh, years ago during the swing era, the drummer was a very featured part of the band. And the more charismatic and visual the drummer was, the more exciting it made the band seem. Rock and roll kind of changed that where it took the guitar player and the vocalist as more your focus and front figures of the band. But I took a little of some of the tricks that I liked from guys like Buddy Rich and those other guys and tried to incorporate it into the rock and roll thing. Simple catches, something like this. They keep always ringing. It's like a telephone. Another one that I like to use is playing my cymbals backwards. Something where I strike the cymbal like this. Sometimes individually within a groove, or sometimes I'll do what I call a windmill, something like this. Anyways, you get the idea, and if nothing else, it helps keep me cool. Now, another aspect that I like to use is something that's what I call like almost like half stick twirls or half spins over my double bass plane over my feet, something like this. But the last visual that I want to show you is something kind of like a crossing over pattern and I kind of mix it up in different directions. Check it out. <laughs> 